a girlfriend of mine calls me in January about a month before I get laid off and she's like, Johanna, stop your life. I have a problem. You need to help me. I'm like, what? She's like, I'm going to the inauguration. I have five balls, three gowns, and I really need you to get online and help me look at for some more dresses. And I'm like, okay, really? You're going to call me? Okay. So we started chatting and I'm helping her look a little bit. And finally, she lived on the East Coast and she said, forget it. She says, I will just find some place to loan me a dress. And I'm like, what? She says, yeah, you can find some place to loan me a dress. And I'm like, shut up. She goes, yeah. She says, I swear there's places out here like that. And I thought that was probably the most brilliant idea I had ever heard. And, and honestly, I really did make an assumption that there were probably a million of these places like this all around. But I'm a typical female. If I have a special event, what, once a year, I buy a dress or I borrow a dress. That's just what I do. That's what all my friends do. And I just kind of dismissed it. About a month later to the day, I get laid off. So I had that idea, which I still thought was brilliant. Start looking for, you know, just looking around, realize that there was an opportunity. And a couple weeks later, a friend of mine who'd been laid off several months before me calls me and she's like, you know, there's this program called Women's Initiative. You might want to look into them. So I had time on my hands now. I look into them and I'm like, huh, could get into it. I opened in November. That is my story.